Hi there, it's Sam from poodles.co.uk. Thank you very much for joining me today. Today I don't have a project to have a video for you. Um, I'm back from my trip to Orlando where I went to on stage live this year and had the most amazing eight days out there. There were four days of stamping up stuff and three and a half days of theme parks, shopping and spending time with my team. But actually, as I've landed back in the UK, we've had an announcement put out that um, firstly, the velvet paper sold out while I was away, so that's part of the limited edition set. Um, uh, Snowflake Showcase, couldn't think what it was called. And we've literally just had an alert a couple of days ago from when you're viewing it, but um, yesterday for me filming it, telling us that there is a bunch of stuff in this catalogue that is likely to sell out. So I do have a list here next to me um basically when it's gone it's gone so we don't know when they can go out of stock we're expecting some of them to go out pretty early so okay let me start at the front of my catalogue because that's probably the easiest thing to do um so santa's workshop designer series paper likely to go the sign paste sign posts likely to go the enamel work uh, the santa's workshop enamel shapes likely to go also expecting the memories and more card pack to go now that has been out of stock once before already and come back in and so is the paper but kind of now it's when it's gone it's gone okay let me flick on a bit more these christmas tags likely to go these are the ones where you die cut all 16 tags in one go they're gonna go um in the woods framelits dies now i haven't actually used these yet but they come as a bundle with this stamp set here which is they have been very very popular obviously hence why it's going to go out but these dies create the 3d elements which you can see perhaps on this one here um possibly not they're expecting to go the joyous noel paper i believe has gone i think that went the day i was flying home have i got two hands that are tanned in different colors you know what i have that's florida sunshine for you anyway <laughs> I hadn't noticed that till now. What else is on its way out? The Frosted Floral Speciality Paper, which has been so, so popular, on its way out. Um, the chicken Wire Elements. Yeah, apparently they're on the way out too. Uh, let me keep looking through. The Cauldron Framelits dies are on their way out. And the Glistered Organdy Ribbon. Organdy? Organdy? I don't know, never know how to say it. Um, that's on its way out. Oh, and I did forget one of these back here, the Sprig Punch, also likely to sell out. So I wanted to let you know that first. Okay, right. So today I'm going to show you the goodies I received from Stampin' Up. And we are very, very lucky as demonstrators. We get lots of stuff. Um, and we always get an amazing tote bag. And this is mine. It's a bit squished where it came where I brought it home but it's sort of like a bucket shape really awesome with a pocket in the front and a pocket inside because actually it's reversible okay and then in there were there was a stamp set I think it was only a stamp set I don't remember can't remember all sorts of stuff okay I am um a senior leader title so I got invited along with I want to say about 300 other demonstrators to go to centre stage live where we were given a free pass to go to Epcot so we went to Epcot and then we had announcements and gifts and all sorts of amazing stuff and this was my gift now this is a demonstrator exclusive stamp set so only demonstrators can get this um, but I love it but I also have a brand new bone folder with Centre Stage 2018 on it and obviously the Stampin' Up! logo now ordinary ones look like that so we've got the new logo on there and obviously they're playing on the other side love it Okay, um, I also picked up four more stamp sets and we've got cling stamps now. As you can see, it's written up here, cling stamp, as opposed to clear mount stamp sets. So these are four that are coming. So we've got a photopolymer one there, a photopolymer one there, a cling stamp and cling stamp here. And this is going to be celebration. Now, cling stamps, I haven't tried mine out yet. Let me get one that I'll be able to prep easier so clear mount and wood mount are no longer going to be around they're now going to be cling stamps and that is so they cling better to your blocks 
and I haven't tried mine yet and I haven't even tried any of Sewing Up's that I had a chance to um, but there's an awesome video out there but they will cling so much better you know what I've taken both sides off that and I should have only have taken one but there we go um, let me see what I can line that up with okay so oh blimey <laughs> that's proper sticky good grief I wasn't expecting that That's not coming off. What Shelley Gardner did advise this was when you're taking it off the block, peel from a corner, because if you pull it like you would normally, you you're likely to rip the um, the foam away. So yeah, that is proper sticky, proper, proper sticky. Um, so yeah, so launching in the spring summer catalog, cling stamps, there will no longer be wood mount or clear mount. There will only be cling stamps and photopolymer. So yeah, five amazing stamp sets. Happy me. Okay, what else did I get from Stampin' Up? So as one of the top performers in the company, we, all top performers, no matter how many categories you rank in, and I ranked in all five, you get a gift from Stampin' Up. And this is my gift which is a beautiful bag it's quite a large one it's got a handle and the matching wallet which is a bigger than I'm a fan of I like a small purse that I can slip in and out of my handbag um, but still lovely and then obviously there's congratulations to you and it's my name on it because inside are certain charms so oh well, we were given um, corsages to wear I didn't want to wear mine because I didn't want to mash it up um, but they're all handmade beautiful and then inside here are five um, charms that represent my uh, ranking so what's this one it says congratulations rock star and in there oh, shall I just open it because I've got to put them on my thing anyway so in here I now have lots of clear treat boxes. This one is personalised to me and it is, um, I think this is the overall in the UK, so it's got the date on it, 2018, it's got my initials SH. And each of those, they'll all be different colours and they will be the in colours, the current in colours. And if I grab my other ones, just stepping across the office. This is what they look like. So this is last year's and the year before. And actually, look at them. Typically, they've tipped themselves all the wrong way round. So there's 10 on there. My charm uh, bracelet that I bought will just about fit this year's on. So that's what they will look like. So that's the first year that we had this global ranking. And then this is last year. So you can see they're the in colours. Those are in colours we've got at the moment, those left us and these ones will all be new in colours and I will attach them on there and they sit on a shelf that I have with my trophies um, from another company I was with and also my trophies for Papercraft Blog of the Year. What else did I get? Oh yes we got these in our bags as well. So a set of three pens, I have to say I do love stamping out pens. Three notebooks, um, and we always get a notebook as well. We always get pens, always get notebooks and badges, which I'll come to in a minute. So they're rather lovely. So the plain notebook there, I believe this one is the planner. That has planner dates in it. And then this one, square, great for sketching. So three of those came in my bag. What else came in my bag? Ah, a letter telling me all of the times I was going to receive recognition, which was quite a lot. One, two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen times I had recognition. So, and it told me Sorry, what time. I can only look for films based on city names. Apparently Alexa heard that. Um, yeah, so it, and it told us what sort of times we were going to be getting stuff. So, okay. Uh, what else came in my bag? We had, we normally we have lanyards, but we didn't. So this 
obviously is my name on there and it's a wallet so really really good and actually I'm going to give this to one of my sons that's my ticket for Epcot whoops so there we go Samantha that was only because there was a bit of an issue um this is this is for prize patrol so those stamp sets came from that and then these are all my ribbons for um, my activity so my title the fact that I got to go to center stage and then all of my performances and I was just going to put them in random order as I normally do and gorgeous Ellie Collins who's in my team Collins and Co um she said oh no put it in a rainbow order because I think one of these colors is new we've never had that color before we've had different ones but yeah so I made a rainbow and then quite a lot of other people clocked on because um one of the official Stampin' Up! photographers spotted me standing and laughing about the length of this and he took a picture which went on the Stampin' Up! page and then afterwards lots of people said to me they'd done the rainbow too and obviously as you know rainbows are my thing that's our team badge and my blog has rainbows so yeah how to make a rainbow gosh what else did we get um this was centre stage so we had a centre stage training and I had sweets in there and this as well so centre stage 30 so I'll hang that in my office somewhere um our programme of stuff so telling us all the time plans and stuff um these are the make and takes and so when you sit and do you know go to a crafting event you get to do crafting projects with stamp sets either you've won or they've been an all attendee giveaway or they're in a box so I tend to bring mine home with me so I've got that and then I have got the ribbons one of the girls trimmed up the ribbon so that we could make our make and takes at home I've got some beautiful new design series paper that's coming out in the spring catalogue and it's gorgeous gingham paper so quite it's, yeah that's the small side and then that's the wider side so you can see the difference lovely full pack of that can't wait to play i believe and judah also known as chicken scratch i believe she's already got a project out on her youtube channel using this paper <laughs> okay what else did we get this i believe is a collapsible bag so it's one of those ones that you carry yes it's a great big tote bag huge great big bag far too big to even get on screen but then it will fold up and you can sort of shove it in your handbag so that you can get it to later or you can you know have it in the boot of your car not taking up space or trunk of your car i'm british it's a boot of my car <laughs> but really really nice and obviously all logoed as well and then finally, and I don't know if this is going to be available to purchase or not. I don't remember. I was just a bit overexcited to get it. A gorgeous toolkit. So it's got big pocket there, place for pens there and there, um, or tools, little zippy pockets there and there. Absolutely brilliant. But I can see if I really do hope this goes to sale because planner addicts are going to go bonkers for it because it's amazing oh there's another make and take bits so to make one of my other projects so it was a good weekend and i did do quite a lot of shopping for myself oh what else have i got to show you <laughs> the main thing i've got our catalogs i cannot show you the inside that's the front cover you'll have seen it all over the place that's the celebration front cover gorgeous and then we get to do, we had about five days to place a pre pre order, so product purchase premiere. So basically, anybody who went to on stage got the opportunity to do a PPP. So, oh, can't show you. So, I will be taking names shortly. Anybody who shops with me anyway um, will automatically get a copy of this with this with it. They will arrive in the post. Um, probably between Christmas and New Year, just because of the timing of it, is it's better for me to get them out then. Uh, but it doesn't go live until the 3rd of January, I think it is. Yeah, 3rd of January. Plenty of time for that. But I will be taking names of anybody who's new to stamping up or new to shopping with me. Let me know and I'll get you on my list. Anyway, right, better go. More videos to do and jet lag to sort out. <laughs> Speak to you very soon. Bye.